good morning good morning good morning everyone how are you guys doing i am doing wonderful this is totally sassy t from the 803 and i am here with a morning video the day after honey the day after the earthquake honey everybody is kind of settling in and getting their thoughts together if you do not know what i'm talking about well, hold on. Wait a minute. I'm going to tell you, sis. Um, but let me get my claims up in it. All right. The number one claim is, guess what? All things on this channel is alleged. In my opinion, it is for learning, teaching, entertainment. When entertainment applies. Okay? Because we do reality and reality TV over him. All right, over here. All right. So, you guys, you guys, you guys. Woo. Martel Ho is the number one liar. You win the first place, honey. You win the first place with your Mr. Muscle Man suit on. How in the world are you going to sit there and lie the way you did? And thank you for the new gems that you gave us because uh, we didn't know anything about you punching your son until you said it. Now, if you can punch him, you most definitely can whoop him. Allegedly, in my opinion, this man is delusional. He's crazy. Y'all, this man can't even get a sentence out of his mouth without melody. When asked, you know, who are you after the marriage, before the marriage, this man never knew who he was. He never knew. His life is not a life without mail. That is crazy to me. And I can see it and it's delusional. It is. He's building himself delusions of grandeur. I'm a good man. Who wouldn't want me? The biggest narcissist. That's what narcissists say. Uh, oh my God, y'all. It was absolutely eye-opening to see a textbook definition of a malignant narcissist. Absolutely unbelievable. But, you know, um, Queen Sheba started out easy on him. And baby, she went in. <laughs> she went in, yeah. She went in the smoother way okay um a lot of people think she should ask questions about you know other stuff but see he started it with the children and she didn't want to go there she wanted to go other ways okay but he started that and he dug a hole and he just kept digging and digging and digging and i don't know what this man is reading in his papers and it's always about who won it's not about who won it's about your children. It's about who and your children, what what is safe for them. To me, you're not a safe person. Cause you was getting up on that, um, you was on that platform last night and you was getting hot and bothered. To the point you say you can pull out from here any moment. That was your choice. You chose to do this interview. I always trying to clear your name. And I told y'all, he done did something. He's done done something else because he wants people to think he's this great man. He's this great guy, okay? He's done something, and you can't tell me because he doesn't do interviews unless his name has been negatively brought up into something. And it's either this Tiffany scene or there's another scene that he's done blew up on, okay? Um, when asked about Belinda... Baby, he couldn't even give a straight answer. It was disgusting. This man uses women and he is lost. He's talking about, you know, he, he his family unit. That's all he was focused on. I, my family, I just want my family back. He wants Mel back so bad. Y'all, Mel, be careful, honey. Be careful. This man is... uh honed in on you and he can't get you out of his mind he can't let it go he cannot let the simple fact that you left him there is no protection for 
him. There's no finance for him. Nobody wants to work with him. And he is really, really going to nut up, okay? The more you say no, the more he becomes delusional. And that is a problem for me, okay? It's a problem for me. Um, I've seen this. I've seen it. I've seen it. He's drinking more. Um, usually, he doesn't drink like that. But he's been drinking. I've heard Martel's been out in these streets drinking like a fool. Um, um, and drinking and fighting and all this stuff. Um, I mean, it was, it was all over the place. His demeanor is scary. Yeah. I, when I saw him, all I saw was a delusional man okay that's all i saw a delusional man with nothing to lose now you talking about scary now that's scary because this joker don't have nothing to lose nothing and when a man ain't got nothing to lose baby Let's just keep it real, okay? I am keeping it 100% real. This man is the biggest liar I have ever seen. I mean, you you can catch some people in a lie sometimes. Like, you can catch Marceau in a lie. Uh, he gonna skate around it. But you gonna catch him in some truths too. But this joker lies on top of lies to the point he don't even know when he started the lie. He couldn't even he didn't pick he didn't take up a melody but he took up an Aryan. He that mess came from Aryan uh, Martell about her not telling her story. That came from Martell. All this. Baby what an eye opener. What an eye opener. This has been Mel's enemy. For, oh my God. He's crazy, y'all. This man is crazy. And I, I hope Mel sees this. And I hope Mel um, really look into the behavior um, and have something done about it. Because, you know, to protect her and her kids. Because this Joker don't have nothing to lose, okay? And in his face, he couldn't take another woman drilling him like that. He, if he could have probably got up and slammed a chair without somebody in his ear saying, man, don't cool, get your cool down. Because it was funny when somebody said, when Queen Sheba said, take those earphones out your ear. Can you take those? No, because he's being coached. This man is a ticking time bomb and has issues. Ain't gonna tell the judge what he wasn't gonna do, but yet contempt of court, yeah, you was contempt, but it wasn't for what you said. And you know it. And Queen Sheba knows it. That's all that matters. I know. She knows. We know the truth. He is still in denial. He is delusional with grandeur. He is I don't know. Y'all, I... It was so unbelievable. I got, I stopped listening when he said he punched his son. I, I, I was like, what? Wait, hold on, wait a minute. Punched? Where that come from? Whew. But anyway, you guys, you know, I will go back and do some, um, do, I'm gonna go back and listen to that live again and, and bring out some points. Um, tonight on my live, um, you guys, thank you for joining me last night. I did a, a quick live last night to see what you guys thought about it. Baby, they were eating Martell A up in the comments. Oh, my Lord. That, oh, including me. I was in the comments, honey. I was going in like a henny hen hen, okay? I was going in like a hen protecting her hen house, all right? Because he deserved to be gone in on. This man was lying from the time he opened up his mouth. 
Um, anyway, you guys, I it's just unbelievable, unbelievable how people lie. Oh my God, and and get caught in them and still try to put another lie on it. Woo. But anyway, thank you guys for listening. If you want to give to the channel, you can cash out Donald Sign Teresa Lindsay Twelve. If you want to support, donate, help build this um, foundation of learning and teaching of you know of life, give support. Donald Sign Teresa Lindsay Twelve, cash out, super chats, and all that jazz. Okay. Um, you guys have a blessed morning. Please, 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 whatever you do, smile, pray, breathe, and enjoy your day. Okay? All right, you guys. Bye-bye.